Round five goes to the NFR rookie, Ty Harris. Ty, how does this feel after a kind of a rough start for you? Yes, ma'am, it was for sure a rough start. It feels amazing. I um, Today, I just wanted to try to make the best run I could, and, I mean, it worked out, but I'm, I'm just really excited to be here. All right, so we noticed a horse change. Tell us about this horse you rode tonight. Um, Iron, it, uh, Walter Johnson owns him. I, he helped me get here, and he's been a blessing for me to be able to ride. And just both horses, Iron and Elgato, I've I've rode them all year, and they've been a huge blessing for me tonight. I felt like Iron would work better on the calf that I had, and uh, it, all, it worked out pretty good tonight. So this is your first r NFR trip. What's been the most exciting thing? Everything, just, I mean, just the experiences and the sights and the people and the fans. I mean, it's, I mean, it's, you can't, you can dream about it, but there's no really, there's no way to prepare for it or, or any, I mean, it's just better than you could dream. So speaking of dreaming of it, we launched a new junior rodeo program. You know, I watched you pretty much grow up. That makes me feel real old. Um, through these junior rodeos, high school, college, how did that build you up to get here? I think just uh, performing in high pressure situations, I mean, it really helps you prepare for, for something like this. It, I mean, obviously that it's not like this, but it's just kind of building you up towards towards this roping against Shad Mayfield and Haven Medjid and Taylor Santos and, and guys like that, and even guys that haven't made it here. You know, I mean, it helps prepare you for roping against Tuff Cooper, <laughs> Marty Yates, Shane Hanshey, Caleb Smith, you know, so. Well, congratulations, and we hope to see you back down here some more this week. Thank you very much. Good job. Miss Debbie.